MovieWeb.com. If the doors of perception were cleansed, everything would appear to man as it is. Infinite. Wake up! Whoa! Or an assassin or something to really be a superstar. You're all a bunch of slaves! How long are you gonna let them push you around? We have taken out two warrants for Jim Morrison. One of them is for indecent exposure. I'd like them to uh, give the music a chance. Part of the film I really thought was interesting was sort of um, where it documents the later albums, uh, especially Morrison Hotel, and, and where the band was sort of starting to tear apart in some places, but you guys were able to kind of keep it together. And I was just wondering, were you sort of cognizant of the importance of keeping the band together at that point, the legacy that the music would have, uh, the impact that it would have, as, as opposed to if the band sort of I broke know, up? We were just trying to keep together just to keep together, you know? We didn't know about the legacy. Who knew the Doors would still be 40 years later that there would still be the Doors? All we, all we knew is we got to make one more album and another one. After you that. don't, as a musician, you should never concern yourself with legacy. You should only concern yourself about this moment in time. You have to capture a Zen moment in time. And that's all you should be concerned about. And if you do that, and we did that because we had opened the doors of perception. We had taken our hallucinogenic substances. We had taken LSD and smoked pot. Realizing that moment in time is infinite and gone in a that's it. Whoa, that snap is gone. This moment of time just disappeared and yet it's infinite. That's what you're going for as a musician. You should never think about legacy. That's only for the press and for uh, hindsight interpretation. But there was a feeling of importance in those moments. Oh, the, the moment is infinitely important. Yeah, yeah that's yeah. when you capture the power and the energy. Robbie's guitar, my keyboards, man, we're playing off of each other, having the time of our lives. John's just holding that beat together. Lefty's playing, hi, I am the bass player, I am Lefty. <laughs> He's playing the bass lines over and over. Jim's just singing his balls off. That's what it's all about, that moment in time. So the magic was still there. The magic, it's albums. magical. Yeah. You must always be aware of the magic you're creating. No, yeah. no that, legacy. That was the only time we had the magic. You know, it's like when we got together and played, mm. you know, everything else, Jim jumping out of windows and stuff, you know, you can't control that. Right. But when you get together to play, then that's, that's when the real magic happened. Why were we together? We were together because of the music. Yeah. This guy came to an audition, what, rehearsal? It wasn't even an audition. He put this bottle, man. I'll never forget it, man. We're doing Moonlight Drive, and Robbie says, you know, this might work. I show him the chord changes. It's very simple G's and C's and whatnot. Robbie opens a guitar case, and in that middle thing, he opens that middle thing and pulls out this weapon, <laughs> this broken glass bottle, man. <laughs> from like a gallo, a green gallo wine bottle, all jagged, fits right in the hand and it's like, <laughs> you know, and I said, where the hell do you play, man? What kind of gigs? I mean, that's a weapon and a half. Yeah, you have to That'll... protect yourself in some of these bars. You would know? <laughs> cut, cut, wow. wow. Robbie says, Ray, that's not a weapon. I said, the hell it's not. He said, no, no, it's a bottleneck. Puts it on his finger and he goes, Bow. Morrison elevates off the floor, you know. About six inches. And Jim said, I love that sound. Wow. Ray, I love that sound. We're going to use that sound on every song we record. <laughs> and I said, wait a minute, man, on every song? He said, all right, all right, wait a minute. I might be in a bit extreme. Maybe not every song, but a lot of them. That's why we're in the band together, because of that. <laughs> that's that sound. Like, that's yeah. what made it. Jeez. That's what made the doors. Whoa. Awesome. Eerie, strange. Great. The rest of it's all peripheral. <laughs> we exist to make music together. That was the great fun, the great spiritual moment. Ladies and gentlemen, the doors. <laughs> <laughs>